Yo, what is going on guys? If you want to get Marvel's Guardians of the Galaxy totally for free, both in Android and iOS devices, then watch this video until the end and I'm going to show you how to do that. Before we start, I'm going to open the game just for you to see that it is fully working on my iOS device and it also works on Android devices, so if you are on Android, it's going to work there as well. So as you can see here, the game is already loading and I can actually play it if I want on my iOS and as I said before, on Android devices. Now, if you are on iOS, there is a couple of settings that you need to change on your phone to install the game and then you can change these settings back, but if you are on Android, you can skip ahead to the part where I open the browser and show you where to get Marvel's Guardians of the Galaxy on Android devices because there is no settings that you need to change on Android, only on iOS. As you can see here, the game is fully working, I can actually play it if I want, if I tap on the start button here, it's gonna start. But we're not gonna do that because I don't want to make this video very long. So let me go on and show you how to get the game, as I said before, both in Android and iOS. And I'm gonna start by showing you the settings that you need to change on your iPhone to get the game. And then we will go on with the steps which are the same both in Android and iOS. And in the end of this video, you're gonna have everything you need to get the games on both devices. So without further ado, let me just start by showing you the settings that you need to change on iPhone. And then we will go on. So first, you need to make sure that your orientation is locked or that your auto rotation is turned off. And you can do that just by tapping on it just like this. So if it's on for you like this, you need to turn it off the same way as I did. Once you have locked orientation, you need to go to settings and then go to general settings. And once you are on the general settings, you need to find background app refresh and make sure that background app refresh is turned on. For me, it's on already, but if it's off for you, if it says background app refresh off, like this, then you need to simply tap on it. You need to tap on background app refresh and then tap on Wi-Fi and mobile data to turn it on. So this is all the settings that you need to change on your iOS device. And now let me show you how to get the game and the steps from now until the end are the same both in Android and iOS. So all you need to do next is you need to open your browser and go to tweakdorm.com. So tweakdorm.com is the website that you need to go. And once you're here, this is how the page is gonna look like. And you'll be able to find Marvel's Gardens of the Galaxy on this site, either on the featured apps or by scrolling down. Or the best option, in my opinion, is by using the search bar. Because once you go to the search bar and start typing Guardians of the Galaxy, if you type Guardians, you're gonna see that the game is gonna show up just like this. And this works both in Android and iOS. So once you find Marvel's Guardians of the Galaxy, you simply need to tap on the game. And then once you do tap on the game, you need to tap on the download now button to basically start downloading Marvel's Guardians of the Galaxy on your iOS and Android devices. Now for the injection of the game to be successfully completed on your device, you will be redirected in a new window where you need to complete a couple of more steps which are very well explained. And then once you complete the six or steps, only then you'll be able to get Marvel's Guardians of the Galaxy on your device. As you can see here, for me, the injection has already started, but as I said before, for the injection to be successfully completed, you'll be redirected in this window here, which says that you need to download two free apps, install them, and complete the instructions for both of them. Sometimes you might have different kinds of offers which are not apps, but that all depends on the country watching this video from. As you can see here, there are several apps that you can choose, and it's very important to at least run the apps for 30 seconds each and complete the instructions below their name. So as you can see here, below the names there are instructions. I'm gonna start with this first app called IRL Social Calendar, and in the instructions it simply says that I need to download the app install it and then sign up for an account. So I'm gonna do that right now and I'm gonna fast forward this part of the video while I download the app, install it and then sign up for an account. Another thing I should mention is that depending on the country watching this video from and depending on the platform, you might get different apps to download or different offers to complete with different instructions, so don't worry if you don't see the apps that are on my list. Once you're done with the first app, go back to the browser and choose a second offer or a second app. I'm gonna choose another one from the list here, and in my case, I'll go one, and let me choose this uh, solitary game, because in the instructions it simply says that I need to download it, install it, and then run it for 30 seconds. Once you tap on it, you're going to be redirected in this new window, and in the instructions here it says that you need to tap on the search app store and then search for card games on the app store here and choose the solitary game that was on the verification window. So I'm gonna go on and do that right now and I'm gonna choose this solitary over here and then you need to tap on the download button and let me fast forward this part of the video while I download Mar 
I mean, while well, I've downloaded Solitary, install it and then run it for 30 seconds. So once you're done with both apps, the last step is the easiest of them all because all you need to do next is that you need to wait 5 to 10 minutes and once you do wait, you're gonna get Marvel's Guardians of the Galaxy on your device installed automatically. And it's gonna look just like this. So let me open the game one more time just for you to see that it is fully working and the quality is really good. And I'm gonna be able to play the game with all its features as it has them on the PC. It's gonna be the same game and it's gonna be ported on iOS and Android devices and you'll be able to play it as well just by opening it like this. So guys, thanks for watching this video and don't hesitate to go and try it yourself. Don't forget to like, subscribe and then turn on notifications for more tutorials like this.